<sighs> we just don't want to do this. <laughs> Welcome to Stupid Movies, where we watch them so you don't have to. Ever. Where we torture ourselves so you don't have to. This week we watched The Goocher. The what? The Goocher. The Goocher. 2020 not rated uh, 86 minutes too long. I'm not going to go over who was in it because I don't <laughs> want to insult any of them. Fair enough. All right, so. The Goocher. The Goocher. Uh, the Goocher. The right Goocher. there. The Goocher. Um, I don't know what the hell happened in this movie. So what happened in this movie? I don't know what the hell happened in this movie. There was like a spy agency and then there was a woman whose dad died and left her money, but she had to kill people. And then there was a group of people in the woods who were getting picked off by the Blair Witch. <laughs> yep. That turned into zombies. That turned into zombies. And when they got hit with sticks, it made a shotgun sound. Right. And there were explosions. Then the army. Yeah. What the hell? I don't know. When six strangers are left in the woods to fend for their lives, there's one enemy they weren't expecting. What, are we watching The Hunt again? Good I goofer. wish we were. I would much rather watch The Hunt. Uh, all right, well, <laughs> we liked The Hunt, so is there anything we liked about the future? Uh, no! I, I like, okay, There's this movie has two reviews on IMDb. One of them is a 10 star and the other one is a 1 star. Uh. The 1 star review. Imagine an intruder breaks into your house. He puts a gun to your head and gives you two choices. Watch the Goocher, or scoop out your own eyeballs <laughs> with the edge of a jagged, rusty tablespoon. I wholeheartedly encourage the prospective viewer to go with option number two. Wow. Yeah, I don't disagree with that. Uh, I like the setting. I like the wooded setting. Okay, yeah, I will. Okay, Then the concept and the setting. I didn't get the concept. Well, okay, okay, the con... Uh, okay, <laughs> hold on. What, what the tagline Judging sounded Judging what cool. the tagline concept is... People throw in the woods, being attacked by something. Yeah, that's a great concept. Yeah. Like I said it reminds me of the hunt. Yeah. So I'm like, oh, this Blair is Witch. Hunt. Blair Witch. Uh, any the, Friday the Thirteenth Part. Any. Any. Yeah. Exactly. So I do like that idea. No. It was shot okay. Yeah. Surprisingly, it was. And not bad. No, it was a little overexposed, but yeah. not bad overall. I, I was impressed with the sound. Yeah, the sound was The good. sound was really good. It was confusing. It was, well, sure. Well, but... why does a stick make a shotgun sound? Yeah, that, uh, I did like that that made me laugh. That did make I me guess. laugh, yeah. Uh, I, so... I want to say something nice about the acting. It wasn't terrible. They did act. Yeah, I mean, I've seen worse. I've seen better. I've, I've certainly seen better. Um, I like... That... It was not generic. Okay. I will give it that. I will give this it that. This was unique. I I don't have anything, dude. Well, okay, well, we don't like not having many likes, so what do we not like about this? Everything! Oh, that's not fair. It's true, but it's not fair. <laughs> I know. The acting wasn't that good. No. And, the okay, my biggest issue was that the plot was just, it was all over the place. It felt like, what was that one shit movie you made me watch <laughs> where... They filmed it, and then the director died or quit partway through, and they shot a whole other movie, and then crushed them together into one. It was a British movie from the 80s. Oh, Spookies. Spookies. This felt like Spookies, where it felt like there were multiple movies that had nothing to do with each other, and they just kind of... Had... And Although, shit them out. Like, they ate all these other movies and crapped out this. Yeah, it, yeah, it's like, what kind of... Uh, I was so lost. I was. I didn't know what the hell was happening. I don't know anything that happened in this movie. Because it was like, oh, they're getting chased by the Blair Witch type uh, Gucci thing. And then all of a sudden there's zombies attack. And then a yeah. ninja shows up. And then they start fighting zombies. And they hit him with a, an axe or a bat. And it's a shotgun blast. And then there were ninjas? Yeah. Yeah. What? And then there was the whole wraparound spy agency thing going on. <laughs> this movie really needed a rewrite. The whole killer demon witch thing in the woods, <laughs> I dig that. Sure. I really do. I mean, that's a me thing. I, I, I enjoy that plot. That's a fun plot for me. And I like seeing it explored a little bit. And even, oh, okay, so the people she kills, 
She ate their souls. I got that much out of it. I kind of like that concept of the witches, you know, sucking their soul out and then they come back as soulless demons. That's kind of a cool idea. Yeah. I just felt like there was too much extraneous bullshit that made no sense and did not drive the plot and just served to confuse me. And really, why did the zombies make shotgun sounds when they got hit in the head with a stick? It wasn't even that big of a stick. I know. And then they, they even did graphics of an explosion... It made no sense. But then the head was still there. Like, I know. I kept expecting, oh, they'll hit a head. It'll blow up. The head will be gone. No, the head was still there. It was like nothing happened. I just, I don't understand. The story was ridiculous. If there was a story, I don't even know. The pacing, it was horrible. I was bored. Even when stuff started happening, I was like, I don't know what's happening. What's happening? I'm bored to death. This sucks. This movie made my hemorrhoids sad. I don't really have much else to say. I don't want to talk about this. There's, I have nothing to say. Like, it's... I actually think you guys should go check it out, watch it, and then write us and tell us what it was about. I don't know. I don't know, I don't know what you want me to say about it. Go watch it and see if you can figure out what it's about. Maybe you'll like it more than we did. I don't know. It's, it's, it was a movie. They technically filmed things. Basically no gore. Absolutely no boobs. Which, usually when I'm looking for a super low-budget indie movie, that's really what I want out of it is gore and low-budget boobies. This movie sucked. I'd, I'd give it a one and a half out of eight. I'll give it a half a point to be nice. I hated this movie. <laughs> this movie sucked ass. And I, I tried to find the good and stuff. And, I mean, there were some small things. Like, you know, it was shot, I mean, competently enough for what they did, I suppose. And it looked fine enough. The sound was impressive. <laughs> Uh, story uh, convoluted mess. I don't know what was happening. I, I'm I'm still confused. It's pretty bad. There's nothing really that I enjoyed about this. I was bored. I was confused. It was terrible. Why do they make noises when you get hit? It's just what <laughs> exactly. I, I, I'm done talking about this pile of poo. Sorry, not sorry. Uh, 0.5 out of eight. Boo, boo. Watch at your own risk, I yeah. suppose. So have you seen the Goocher? Uh, do you understand it? Let us know down below. All that. Follow, like, all that mumbo jumbo. Tell your friends! Just do it. I don't imagine we're getting any new fans off of this. Oh, I'm sure not. But, you know, good job making something there. You know, that's more than what we've done. So That's true. You've made more of a movie than we have. Absolutely. We would not make good movies, I'm sure. No, so. I know we wouldn't. We'd be horrible. <laughs> we would be terrible. Uh, we so can't act. We can't act, no. But... Whatever. You can follow us over on Stupid Movies on the Instagram, at Stupid Movies. You can also go to Facebook.com slash Stupid Movies. And uh, you can email us at StupidMovies.outlook.com. Do not show us your Goocher. I don't know what a Goocher is, and I don't really <laughs> want to see it. Paint your penis like a zombie, take a picture of it, and send it to Rob. He's starting a Goocher collection. Oh! I'm confused why we watched it in the first place. I don't know, because uh, he's an ass. <laughs> oh, I, I do want to point out that this movie is Rob's fault, because he asked me at like 5.30 in the morning. I was barely awake. I was in a bad mood. And I was like, I'm going to pick the worst fucking movie I can find. And that was this. <laughs> it's pretty bad. Yeah. <laughs>